Marburg virus is baked into the shots and will be activated by three one minute pulse waves at 18 gigahertz from the 5G towers all over the country. The government has been preparing for this for years now and will be released in October of 2023. Yup, this might happen to your phone in exactly a few weeks. If you have a US phone on October 4th at exactly 2.20 p.m., your phone will blare one of the loudest sounds possibly ever recorded in history. Not only that, every radio and TV station that exists in the US will also be blaring that same sound. The US is launching its first ever emergency broadcasting alert system since 1951 that will go out to every device in the US and it will be terrifyingly loud. It's reported since it will all be happening at once, other countries may be able to hear an echo of this alert. The emergency alert system is set to test if every device is able to receive an emergency alert at the same time, and it's reported that this loud sound will last over a minute long. Oh, and silencing your phone won't be able to stop that. Wednesday, October 4th marks the beginning of the end of existence as we know it, thanks to 5G and that damn vaccine. Yeah, again. Random social media users aren't pulling their conspiracies out of nowhere, though. They reel off a bunch of would-be facts and figures that must be coming from some sources they believe, for some reason. We know that Marburg is not particularly contagious, but it has an extraordinarily high rate um, of fatality. And we know the mechanism by which this will be released. And that is, inside of these shots that people already received, inside the lipid nanoparticles, the hydrogel, there exists pathogens inside of the particles that have not yet opened. Those pathogens are chimeric. They include E. coli Marburg, Ebola staphylococcus, and brewer's yeast, amongst others. We know that upon the broadcast from the 5G system that is now employed across the United States and the world, for that matter, um, when they broadcast an 18 gigahertz signal uh, for one minute, three different times as a pulse, it will cause those lipid nanoparticles to swell and release these pathogenic contents, thereby causing a Marburg epidemic that they've already spent the money on. They've already, it's already done, right? The Marburg epidemic, for purposes of the law, has happened, and now we just need the actual uh, disaster to happen. And, and there's actually worse parts to it than that, including the 1P36 gene deletion that effectively will turn those poor people into zombies. Zombies, bro. Zombies. Seems like the experts that never seem to be right about these predictions never lose any credibility. But if they do, there's always a new crop ready to predict the next one. And since money's usually the driving force behind nearly everything, I wonder where the money's being made in these predictions. Maybe they're in the aluminum foil business. And lately, business ain't been that good. Just wanted to say that um, it's very important to take all your electronical things, anything that can have Bluetooth, smart TV, smartphone, anything that is smart, that get, can get a signal from the, sorry, that can get a signal from uh, the 5G towers, which, by the way, should be put down everywhere, the 5G towers, because on the 4th of October, they're going to send a signal from there that can destroy everyone. Uh, so what you should do is take aluminum foil and wrap them up and put them in your vehicle 200 meters away from your home and also take a place in your house, a room in your house and put aluminum foil two, three times layers in that place and stay there from the 4th to the 5th of October. Believers in this stuff can listen to a guy reel off multiple names of nanoparticles and chemical reactions, which make them feel like he really knows what he's talking about. But in that same thought, they think that the solution is the most comically mocked remedy, an aluminum foil. But this time, not as a cone on top of your head, but an unspecified amount plastered in a room or around your house. The folks like this woman that are tricked into these beliefs are actually the real victims because she's legit concerned and taking even more precautions. And also you should have uh, get a heavy metal detox because all the chemtrails that they've been spreading have aluminum and it is proven if you don't believe me, just swipe your vehicle, put that dust on a paper, take an element and put it underneath and you'll see all the aluminum that sticks to it. So you have to have a detox, a heavy metal detox. You can get them, just look it up. You can get the, the, the pills um, in pharmacies and natural product places and on Amazon. Again, 
The fix for this zombie apocalypse is Reynolds Wrap aluminum foil and some heavy detox that they sell on effing Amazon. The same Amazon that Jeff Bezos controls, who has to be one of the main players in the partnership with the New World Order to turn sheeple into zombies. Why would he not be involved, right? But then again, the real question is, aren't all the sheeple already zombies? <laughs>